Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to talk about my top 5 favorite serums from the Dermaco. And these are the serums that I genuinely use and I absolutely love. And I think you should definitely, definitely try out these serums according to your skin preference. I have tried a lot of facial serums that are available in Indian market. But these are the serums from this particular brand that really stood out for me. Also, I have a couple of empties as well as some reproaches that I will talk about. But before that, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit on that notification bell so that every single time I upload a video, you will get notified and you don't miss out on anything. Now, without rambling much, let's go. Starting off with this 2% Kojic Acid Face Serum and oh my god, this is my holy grail product, okay? So this is a 2% Kojic Acid Face Serum for dark spots and pigmentation. It has 1% of alpha abitin, Kojic Acid as well as niacinamide. And if you guys don't know already, I just came back from a vacation and I have tan all over my body, especially on my forehead. I have patches, you know? So what I don't really like about tanning is you get patches it's not even so you need to deal with those hyperpigmentation and tan lines and that's when it comes to play i've been using it every single day and i think my skin is doing quite better now along with kojic acid this serum is loaded with one percent of alpha abidin that effectively helps in fading dark spots with every application it controls the production of melanin and gives you an even toned complexion this serum fights pigmentation, fades dark spots, acne scars and improves skin discoloration. This also has protective antioxidant benefits that neutralizes the damage caused due to pollution, UV ray smoke and toxins. All Dermaco products are dermatologically tested, safe and fragrance free. Kojic acid is often used in skincare products for its skin brightening properties. By skin brightening properties, I mean this is going to deal with your hyperpigmentation. This is going to even out your skin tone if you have acne scars or marks or blemishes. And also this is commonly used to deal with melasma and age spots. Now I hope you guys can see I have finished this one completely. Also I have a newer bottle. So this is something I just can't live without and one thing I would definitely like to mention with kojic acid or any other active ingredient do definitely use a sunscreen in the daytime because if you are using any active ingredient it might sensitize your skin. So definitely use a sunscreen and you are good to go. Now this is very lightweight on the skin. It doesn't feel heavy sticky or greasy so you can just apply it. It blends into the skin and I prefer using it at night. Demaco has empowered 10,000 students this year with their young scientist initiative and every time you buy from them they will link your order to a child that they help educating along with Bumi. I do have a coupon code with them if you use that on their website you will get extra 20% off but this is not an affiliate code so I'm not gonna make any money out of it this is just for my subscribers. The next one I just can't do without is their 2% salicylic acid serum. So this is the Dermaco 2% salicylic acid serum for active acne. This has salicylic acid, witch hazel and willow bark. Now this is something I rely on completely. I have acne prone skin and I get small little bumps all over my face. Sometimes I get active acne or breakouts. So this is something that saves me from that. Even if you are getting active acne, you can just spot treatment like that and this is going to dry down your acne. Salicylic acid is known for its exfoliating and anti-inflammatory properties. Also with this one I would recommend you to do a patch test and then use it if you are using it for the very first time. Now this is going to deal with your acne, blemishes, dark spots, clogged pores or if you have whiteheads or blackheads. Salicylic acid is BHA which is beta hydroxy acid. This has exfoliating properties. So this is going to deeply exfoliate your skin and it's going to reveal you brighter and clearer looking skin. I use it two to three times a week and I use it at night only. Now this is a serum I have almost finished up okay I just have two to three uses left and I'm not repurchasing this one for now because currently I'm using this one. This is the Dermaco Salicinamide Anti-Acne Serum. This has 2% salicylic acid as well as 5% niacinamide. So currently I'm using this one and I'm very happy with this one. Now coming to this particular serum this is the dermaco salicinamide anti-acne serum with 2% salicylic acid and 5% niacinamide this particular serum is 
is specially designed to address active acne, acne scars, pigmentation or textures. Salicylic acid is going to unclog your pores and help with your acne issues and it has niacinamide that's going to deal with your hyperpigmentation that's going to even out your skin tone and niacinamide also soothes and improves your skin barrier. So this is a versatile solution for a clearer smoother looking skin and if you are someone who don't like using too many serums at once you can try this particular product out as it has anti-inflammatory anti-acne or anti-pigmentation benefits also this is something i would highly recommend you to use two to three times a week at night now coming to a niacinamide serum now this is a product i have finished two or three bottles and this is a repurchase i have just opened it yesterday i think so this is their 10 percent niacinamide face serum for acne marks this has niacinamide and zinc niacinamide serum is an active form of vitamin b3 and this is a versatile skincare product i would say this is jack of all trades so no matter what skin concern you have you can try this one out be it acne prone skin if you have pigmentation if you have age spots or if you have redness or sensitive skin or if you have oily skin or if you have supremely dry skin you can try a niacinamide serum this is going to regulate your oil production it repairs your skin barrier if you have hyperpigmentation or acne scars acne marks or blemishes this is going to deal with that if you have small little bumps all over your skin if you have sensitive skin this is going to soothe your skin this has anti-inflammatory properties this is going to improve skin barrier function it reduces redness or inflammation and also this is going to minimize the appearance of pores fine lines wrinkles or blemishes and i would say if you have any of these issues definitely definitely try a niacinamide serum this is the 10 percent font if you're a beginner i would recommend you to start with the five percent and then go with the 10 percent incorporating niacinamide in your skincare routine it's going to provide you a smoother radiant glowy clearer looking skin and lastly i'm going to talk about another empty of mine which is the dermaco 10 percent vitamin c serum i am completely over this one and this is the 10 percent vitamin c face serum with 5 percent niacinamide vitamin c and hyaluronic acid as you guys can see i have finished this one completely and currently i'm using the 20 percent vitamin c serum because i already have that one so i am just trying to finish that one up but 10 percent vitamin c serum is i would say is more than enough vitamin c serum is a potent antioxidant in skincare and this has a lot of benefits like it has anti-aging properties this is going to even out your complexion this is going to deal with your scars and marks it reduces dark spots stimulates collagen production and it gives you an even toned brighter looking skin and regularly using vitamin c can improve your overall skin texture and it also saves you from environmental damage now when it comes to vitamin c a lot of people will recommend you to use in the daytime followed by a sunscreen but if you are not reapplying your sunscreen this is going to overly sensitize your skin which is not recommended okay so i use my vitamin serum only at night and follow it up with a sunscreen in the daytime and if you are using your vitamin c serum in the daytime don't forget to reapply your sunscreen in every two to three hours which is a little difficult for a lot of people i know so in that case i would recommend you to use your vitamin c serum at night follow it up with a sunscreen in the daytime currently i'm using this 20 percent vitamin c serum from the Dermaco. but if you are a beginner i would not recommend you to use the 20 percent one start with the 5 percent one then go with the 10 percent one and if you are a pro then only go for the 20 percent one because using vitamin c serum is a little bit tricky so definitely do a patch test and just see if it suits you or not because a lot of people i have seen is allergic to vitamin this 20% vitamin C serum has ferulic acid and hyaluronic acid and as this has 20% of concentration so I definitely use it at night only. One thing I would like to recommend here if you have super super sensitive skin definitely start with a lower concentration of L-ascorbic acid. Also you can look for serums which are containing magnesium ascorbyl phosphate or sodium ascorbyl phosphate which are more gentler on the sensitive skin while giving you the same benefits of a vitamin C. I will mention the names right here. You can just check these ingredients out while choosing your vitamin C serum. 
And lastly, I'm going to say that guys, I'm not a skincare expert, okay? If you are a beginner and if you are starting off with active ingredients and if you don't know which active to choose, definitely visit a dermat for personal guidance, okay? Now, these are my top 5 serums from the Dermaco that I use and I have incorporated them in my skincare routine and I find these are really amazing. And I would like to recommend you to definitely do a patch test before trying any of these active ingredients and follow it up with a good amount of SPF in the daytime be it SPF 50 or 60 for best results hope it helps I hope you guys like this video and find this video helpful if you do then definitely like share and subscribe to my channel and hit on that notification bell so that every single time I upload a video you will get notified and you don't miss out on anything and yeah that's it for today's video I will see you soon in my next one bye